Welcome back guys to the channel to another video. So today I'm hopefully able to help you. <clears throat> sorry, if I'm my voice is crackling or something, I'm very sorry straight away. I'm under the weather, so I'm a bit sick. But yeah, so I'll show you guys around how to fix your FPS to improve because a lot of people are like watching my video and like saying like, why on this map are you having like, you know, 110 and 115 FPS and etc, etc. I'll show you guys how to fix it on your PC. It's it's not really crazy hard and yeah, I, th I think it's gonna help for the community a bit. So this is the settings. You get the mod for get the mod more, and that's pretty much it. If you guys still don't have sane, I'll make sure I'll leave it straight away in the description so you can guys download it. Right. So make sure I always have announce key on whatever. Mine was in minus because I literally don't use that key, so <laughs> it works perfectly fine for me. So you can copy the settings like this. I'm not gonna go too much through the set settings because I don't want to make the video way, way, way too long. So. DMC wave quality is pretty simple. How much was, was the quality of the waves going to be? It's very simple. So if you have guys low end PC, I would recommend spawn smoothing enabled. It will load bots lower and it's just going to be less strain on your PC. So yeah, that's going to help. You can try copying all this while I'm running right now. Obviously, it might if you're low end PC, you might need to reduce certain things. The worst part about the SPT is the bosses eats entire your PC guys. If you're running guys low end PC, I would recommend playing this game without PCs. So if you if you prefer playing with scavs, obviously leave the scavs on, you know, don't don't leave the scav quality zero. Obviously just turn it back on. Just make it, you know, on whatever it was. It was on one apparently. So next thing it's gonna eat up a lot of PC from these settings is both boss open zones. Disable it. If you have guys in low end PC, don't even bother testing with this one. It's gonna crash it. Uh, random ro uh, radar groups, <clears throat> absolutely fine. Doesn't need too much FPS. It's basically, I think, almost like three or five FPS difference was. Uh, row groups, same. Maybe like it's gonna eat up like three, four FPS. But if you're not gonna play with bosses, <laughs> you're just gonna be up like on 30 plus FPS, 100%. Uh, boss invasions, disable that. Don't need that. You don't need bosses if you're landing, running low NPC. Uh, this one, uh, same. Turn it off, guys. If if you're not running a good PC, it's not worth it. You might as well just play with tons of AIs in the game instead of bosses. So I'll show you the difference in this game between with bosses and without bosses. So always after you you change some settings, guys, make sure you press save. So push it to the latest uh, settings to the server. You get that announcement. Make sure you have your my mi your minus. <laughs> Not minus, I mean your button, guys, which you're gonna check it. Right. I would definitely recommend if you're doing this, guys, make sure you create an account. Okay. So with these settings, you guys are gonna have a bit longer loading screen. Like for ground zero, it's like 30, 40 seconds. Woods, it's like, I would say, for me, it was I think so, like longest one was one minute and 10. But I was loading a lot of, I think, so bosses or something at the start of the game. So you can keep checking on my FPS. You see it like instantly the AIs are loading in like it's building up slowly. I'm going to start moving, moving, moving. And it's going to drop to like 40 FPS here because the boss is going to start spawning. Obviously, I'm not going to die from shots or anything. You see like FPS are constantly just dropping. Like it's generating the AIs. And the AIs are spawning and spawning and spawning. They're going to start fighting soon. 92. And it's just gonna rise up again, gonna drop again, rise up again, drop again. So with these ones, I'm that this is why I'm getting here. Obviously, if I can if I if I'm gonna when I show you guys how I'm gonna remove bosses, it's gonna be great FPS, it's gonna be like consistent 100 FPS. But it's not it's not like you're getting stuttering on anything. You see, there we go. One is walking around. Obviously, I don't have any footsteps, guys. So this this is just for testing. Testing another mod. Like, it dropped to 69 FPS already. 60. That means underneath we have bosses. <laughs> the guy is going yellow. I think he's inside. Oh, he's behind the wall. So let's say I kill one. So I killed two, and now there's two more. There we go. His friend is coming back. So I just threw the window. 
So now there's another one that's going to come in and one more. Plus, from shooting, would say now the eyes are actually running towards you. I'm just waiting because there's, there's... Oh, underneath. He was. His friend is coming from underneath. But keep an eye out for the FPS, guys. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Okay. That's three. And there's one more friend of his. That's a fixer was the boss. No. He just had, had the skin. I really thought that because there's a woods boss looks with this one. Oh, I'm having a lot of stuttering. The bosses are spawning. And that's his last friend. Oh, that's a different wood. Okay. <laughs> Obviously, if you guys want to just test it. And there's a the boss. Tip. And you had a. Like, I had a boss spawn, right? Here. And now FPS is gonna keep coming back slowly. But, like, as you can see, co consistently the bo mobs are spawning here. You don't need to ever worry about it. There's another world boss here. So yeah, so you're constantly fighting against bosses. So, but I'm still getting, you know, consistent 60 FPS here and woods is sometimes sometimes it drops, but yeah. You see? This is how you guys pretty much fix it. So now we're gonna run back run out. I just wanna check it. I never saw this boss, so I <laughs> wanted to check uh, what, what loot he has. Don't have any, any ammo, I'm just gonna grab for somebody a gun for the next one. There we go, guys. All right. I showed you guys this one. Showed you the FPS. It dropped to like it's, it's slowly dropping because now now I killed like what two three groups plus the bosses, and it's slowly dropping FPS because now it's loading back up the new ones. You know, so we're gonna get out of the game. We're gonna turn off the bosses and leave only PMC raiders. I never saw this one. Oh, that's me. Okay, let's extract really fast. I'm gonna turn off the bosses and I'll show you guys the difference in FPS. You're gonna notice a big, big difference. Relax, guys. Relax. I'm out. <laughs> Going crazy. All right. So even with this amount of AIs in, in the map, like consistently spawning, I'm still having a pretty... Like, I would say 60, 67 FPS is not that bad for this game. Okay, let's track. We're gonna we're gonna turn off the bosses now, and you're gonna see a difference in FPS and loading. Random upgrade boss open zones off. Uh, this one disabled. Boss invasion disabled. Random groups blah blah. blah. Disable bosses. Yeah, that's perfect. Make sure we need to save it. Okay. Everything pushed up. Okay, we're gonna load back up ground zero. Just in case if something gonna go bad, right? For game settings here. And disable. Just in case. Just in case if something gonna go wrong, the boss is not gonna spawn in the game for you. Just to make sure everything is off for bosses. I'm gonna check the FPS now. And even the loading screen is gonna be a bit faster, I think so. Okay. Loading back in. Okay, no bosses in the game, only raiders and PMCs. And and goons and goons. Don't forget about the goons, guys. Don't forget about those. Alright. As always, I forgot on the last one. Current preset, custom. Okay. Everything looks fine. Now yeah, everything's gonna load in. Obviously you can re reduce the wave qualities, guys. So you know, like from three to one, one point five, whatever it's like it's gonna be good for your PC guys. Right, let's run run around. See what FPS we're gonna get now. The bosses are off the maps. Looks looks stable now. Look. 
110, 116. AIs are already spawned. Not getting any stutterings. Perfect. You see? How much... Uh, it eats away from me 60 FPS in the game, the bosses. 60 FPS. Is it worth it? You guys tell me in the comment section. Is it worth it? Is it worth it to get minus 60 FPS? So you can only just fight the bosses. I don't think so. I don't think it's worth it. Where's all the where's all the bots? Oh, it dropped. I think so everything everybody spawned already. Yeah, but I'm getting like without bosses, I'm getting consistent 100 FPS now. Obviously, the more the more AI is gonna load up in the map, obviously it's gonna be way much more strain on PC. But you can always reduce some amount of it. And the, and the south gears are actually so bad right now. For, at least I don't know what's happening. I think I messed up something. Oh, hello. Are you across? Oh, there you go. Give me a sec. Need to load up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, me too. Give me a sec. <laughs> Need a gun. Right. I just wanted the guys to show you. That's the difference in FPS. And you can re and I'm running tons of AIs and fast respawns here. So if you guys just <laughs> wanna play the game, just remove it. remove it. And just just enjoy the game. It's not it's definitely not worth it. Having having bosses in the game, just just to, and playing on you know thirty FPS. You rather wanna play like, you know, a lot of bots in the game, a lot of fighting. Look at it. This guy's already here. Fight, wanna fight me? Yeah. And have a consistent FPS. They never have any stuttering. So, guys, I hope you guys enjoy the video. Like and subscribe. Show me some love. I'll see you in the, in the next one, next video. Let me in the comment section if you're having any problems and you want to have some presets or something. Let me know in the comment section. Definitely. I'll, I'll, when I have free time, I'm definitely going to look it up. I'll see you in the next one. Take care.